In this video, we are having a look at inserting bullet points within Word and also how to define a new bullet point. Firstly, to find the bullet point option, you go to the Home tab and in the Paragraph section on your ribbon, the Bullet Point Options button is just here. There are two parts to this button. The main part will just insert a bullet point. The style of it will just be the last star that was used. Or you can click on the drop down arrow here where it gives you a variety of different styles of bullet points to choose from. So first of all, I'm just going to click on the main part to insert in a bullet point and you can see it is now here in your Word document. I'm going to type something in and hit enter and you'll see that the bullet point now has continued down to the next level. Same again, if I hit enter you can see it's now down to the third option. So from here, of course, I could continue my list, but if I wanted to finish the list at that point and remove the bullet points, there are a couple of ways to do so. First of all, you can click back on this button and it removes the bullet point from your list. You can also hit the backspace key a number of times and you'll be able to see across the ruler at the top that this indent is now back in line with where it was to begin with. A final way is to hit enter once you've gone down to that third option, that third line, and of course it removes the bullet point as well. So that is just inserting in, of course, bullet points within a Word document. From here, of course, you can select a number of different bullet points from the options. You can see, if you look behind, you can see that there are a number of different styles that you can see. If none of those are to your liking, you can define a new bullet point by clicking on the option at the bottom of that list. And you can see there are three options to choose from. You can, of course, click symbol, and you can select from a list of pre designed symbols built into words. Picture, where you can then, of course, go to your filing system to find a picture and insert that in as a bullet point. Or font. You can select a certain type of font for a bullet point. Often symbol is used because, of course, that makes a bit more sense to have as a bullet point. So from these three options, the most, probably most popular ones to use are symbol or picture. Of course, that is just now just inserted a plain one as we didn't select a different option. So that is just inserting bullet points and how to define a new bullet point within Word so you can use those in your Word documents as well as text.